Every time I hit the corner, I be turning heat. I be turning heat. I be, I be turning heat. Every time I hit the corner, I be turning heat. I be turning heat. I be, I be turning heat. Hello today. My name is D Landry of One Entity Productions. I am here with the ever illustrious Misfit Crazy Eight. Uh, 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 uh. And uh, we're doing his interview for Fly Fest 2012, May 19th, 2011. Be there. First question is, what is your favorite flavor ice cream? Hmm. <clears throat> I'd probably have to say chocolate chip cookie dough. I like that. It's probably my favorite. Always was my favorite. Interesting. Interesting. Already crossing the cover line. I like where this interview is going. <laughs> what is the last book that you've read? The Jungle Book. Hmm. With Mowgli and Baloo. Not The Jungle by Upton Sinclair? Uh, no. Hmm. no. 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 Not read that. <sighs> okay. Okay. Simple, simple question. Yeah. Now we're, now we're going to get to the harder questions now. Are you ready? All right, let's do it. I don't think he's ready, but we're going to see. All right. You have a song called Tribal Dance in which you describe your African roots. Mm -hmm. So let me ask you this. Would you rather be a black Republican or girl number two from two girls in one cup? Um... <laughs> hmm. Come on, not a, not a hard question at all. Um, tribal, African roots, connects to black, Republican, and two girls, one cup, your girl number two. Uh, well. We hear you went to college, which you've mentioned influences your music, so here's a question from college. What's the square root of 81? Uh, Times I. You know what I is, right? You went to college. You went to Tulane. Come on. Uh, I mean. It's a great school. I, imaginary number, square root. It's easy. Come on. Uh, what you major in? Communications? I'm sure. Don't answer that. You have a song called I'm a Martian which you are working on a video for. Um, have you ever been probed by Martians? And if so, do you <clears throat> like it? I mean, uh, what, what's wrong? Uh, I, 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 maybe Simple I'm- Simple question. Maybe I'm missing, maybe I'm missing the point. I, I don't, I don't understand how this even relates to- Don't answer that. I have something I'd like for you to hold up. Something simple you can do. Did you hold up the shirt, please? Um. The planners of the event, Fly Fest 2012. Would you mind holding it up, please? Okay. A little bit higher. So the people at home can see it. Okay, so. Hi higher, please. Higher. Well, I'm, I'm not in. The, I, I'm I understand. Okay. Higher. Yes. Perfect. Thank you. Don't peek out from the shirt, please. Thank you. Here's the next question. You have a song called I'm a Martian that you're currently working on a video for. Okay. Please don't put the shirt down. The song references extraterrestrials. Were you at any time abducted by extraterrestrials? If you were abducted, were you probed anally? Please hold up the shirt. I'm doing this well, to hide your shame. I don't. I mean, hold, hold the shirt. None of that, please. Okay, but well, none of that. None of that has anything to do with. It has everything to do the with the song. The song is called "I'm First Person Nominative, A Martian." This Martian extraterrestrial. Have you ever been probed anally? And if so, were you sexually aroused by it? No, I mean no, no. Thank you. That's it. Thank you. That's all. That's all I need. Okay. That's that's it. All right. Thank you. 
You mentioned you're doing a, a re-release of your project, State of Emergency. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. I've, I've read a lot of reviews on it. Re-release it. At what point did you realize it was an utter, irrefutable piece of crap that you were going to be re-releasing upon this planet? Reason that, you know, I don't. I mean, I guess that's what you think about it, but I know that's it's not what I think about it. It's I read reviews on it. And one of the reviews said it was so bad that after song number two, he used the CD as a coaster. Why are you re-releasing this on the planet? He said, okay. Um, okay. Um, the, reason, the reason I'm re-releasing it is because, you know, <clears throat> I feel like, you know, every, every year we're getting better. Uh, I'm getting better. And this is just something I wanted to... I felt was it didn't reach its full potential because just of a number of factors and I wanted to really give my fans something that that was that I felt was of the utmost quality and I, I feel like that's what we're gonna give them this time. Okay. You know, good answer. Good prepared answer. Final question. Do you have a song with Devin the Dude? Local Houston rapper. Right. Raps mostly about marijuana and drinking beer and Right. Talking to fat chicks. Yeah, that was a cool experience. Oh, uh, hold on, hold on one second. I'm getting a call right now. <clears throat> uh, excuse me. How are you? Yeah, I'm, I'm doing this interview. This guy, Misfit Crazy Eight, um, local Houston rapper from Lafayette, Louisiana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man, I don't know, man. He. He called me up. He wanted me to do this interview. He's doing this show called Fly Fest on May 19th. Yeah, he's in. Yeah, load of crap. All right, Devin. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Man, that was... It's funny. We we're just talking about Devin the dude. He's right. That was him. That was, this, last question. How was it working with such a brilliant mind? Somebody that was... Much better than you lyrically, much better than you as far as the number of albums and just longevity. How was that? In, <clears throat> you know, uh, you know uh, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. What are you talking about? I'm not, it's, I'm not it's, fucking doing it. What, this. man? I, come on, Misfit! Misfit Crazy 8? Come on! Every time I hit the corner, I'll be turning heads. I'll be turning heads. I'll be, I'll be turning heads. Every time I hit the corner, I'll be turning heads. I'll be turning heads. I'll be, I'll be turning heads.